forgot the music was so fire. No, I didn't forget, bro. Bro, this music. Ooh. Da, 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 da. Wait till that bass drop hits. Anyways, though, what's up, Ant City, and welcome back to some more SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. In the last one, we finally made it here to the Merma Lair. We just started it. We haven't even made it past the first room yet, but we've already done everything in here that we needed to do. Oh, the bass. I'm sorry. Just the drop in the song. It's such a good song, bro. I'm telling you, when I finish this series, I'm about to add some OST to my playlist. That's all I'm saying. But anyways, yeah, we're here in the Murmur Layer. And today, we're just going to go ahead and continue and hopefully maybe finish it. I don't know how long this area is, though, to be honest. But yeah, we're just going to go ahead and continue onward. Get out, get out of my way, bro. Get out of my way. Yes, yeah, so we have this box here that we can go through. But for now, we're just going to head straight into the next area, the Murmur Layer main chamber. So yeah, let's go. The Mermelair, secret fortress of the wrinkly superheroes Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. Squidward, am I happy to see you? And not just the kind of happy you feel in the front of your knees, but the kind of happy you feel in the back of your elbow. Oh, you'll never believe what's been happening. Yeah, yeah, I've already been briefed by the geriatric duo. Those two old coots sent me in to get updated with the Mermelair computer. But since you're here now, I'll let you do it. It's right over there. Oh, look at this place. I mean, police. Would it kill them to lay down a few throw rugs? And all this wasted space? How did those two old fogies make all this? Oh, that's easy. In episode 27, the Mermelair is invaded by the digging monsters of Bermuda, and they... Never mind! Well, what is Squidward even doing in here, though? Like, why did he just decide to help Mermaid Man a Barnacle? He was like... I guess I can come in there. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Anyways, that was a terrible score and impression. Anyways, uh, yes, yeah, so that was the lobby. So look how big this place is, though. Like, Jesus. Remember, just got here. I guess he got here right before us. I don't know. Anyways, though, we about to spin the platform. Here, I guess. Spin this over here. Wait, those things shoot lasers. You gotta be careful. So where are we going? So we can, there's a lot of ways we can go. We can go to the right. We can go up. There's like a there's a lot of different. Possible. Let's start over here. Why not? If I can swap characters. Oh, there's Mermaid Man chilling, watching his. Who gonna be? Oh, Patrick? I hope it's Patrick. We haven't seen Patrick in a bit. It's Patrick. What's good, Patrick? Yeah, it's been like a bit since we got to play as Patrick, so I'm kind of glad that he's finally back with us. You know, it's just been a hot minute since we've just seen the boy. So, yeah. Anyways, um, yeah, because last area we got, we only played as Sandy, so Sandy and SpongeBob, and that place lasted a while. But let's talk to Mermaid. I've got a job for somebody who can throw things. Leave it to us. I'm great at throwing things. All you have to do is pick up a throw fruit and throw it into each of those funnel machines. Throw, throw oh, the throw fruit? Throw. No, throw the throw fruit. Throw the tofu. You might want to be quick about it. I tend to explode. I mean, they tend to explode. Okay, so they these things explode. Why, why is he just watching TV here though? Like he was just over there. What is that area? How do we get to that? Hold on, what is that about? Okay, well I guess we'll figure that out later. That little hole in the wall. I did not know what that was. But um, oh maybe that's what this is for. Patrick Peter. Oh, it's probably gonna launch me in there. We'll go there in a bit. We're gonna do the fruit thing first though. Like they said, these things tend to explode. You gotta be careful. Whoa. Get up. Or, tilt it. There we go. There we go. And throw it in. Hit the button. Oh, oh they're blowing up. Ooh. Why do we have exploding watermelons? Like, what? Anyways, um. But now we gotta step. Oh, oh, we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Oh, oof. I was not following the pattern properly. Let me off. Let me off. No! Okay, let's try that. Okay, luckily it do, it does keep that last button a hit pressed for me. So okay, that's good. So let's just follow the pattern again. Yeah, th there we go. This makes this way easier. All right, we're off. Hit the button. And then now, oh, they all turn blue now. Okay, perfect. That's what we needed. Okay, so we just need to grab one more and hit this one, which is 
Looks like it's just like a straight shot, so. Oh, never mind. It's shooting cannon. We just gotta stay away from it. There you go. Hit that. Now what? I guess we just gotta talk to Mermaid Man again. So let's see if he'll give me some. You did it! Now I can get some sleep. He said, oh yeah, he does give us five. He said, now I can get some sleep. Man, you're sitting up. You are not getting no sleep. You're watching static on the TV, bro. Like, he probably will pass out. Oh, he's old. He'll probably pass out right away. Look at how HD Mermaid Man looks, though. Like, compared to Patrick, look at how detailed the graphics are on him. Like, look. Look at how detailed those graphics are. And look at Patrick. Like, Mermaid Man's just so HD. It's crazy. But, um, I guess while we're here, let's see. How many do we have? We have... I guess we can pay for this. But where? Oh, it's right here. So we can launch ourselves. Where does this take? Because I have no idea. Um, I guess we could do it right now. Yeah, since we're here, might as well. So let's see what this does for us. Throw it. Where's it take? Hey, I know you. You're that guy. Bitch swear. Hmm. We're gonna need a lot more power to activate the hydroacoustic Doppler modulator. You think you can handle this? I can see Squidward's house from up here. And he's not wearing any pants. Oh wait, he never wears pants. Now listen up. There are eight cylinders over there. If you throw something at the cylinders, it'll turn around to the power side. Turn all eight cylinders around to the power side and I'll give you a reward. Sorry, what was that? I was watching Squidward. Just start turning those cylinders. Where, where is Patrick seeing Squidward's house? Like, we're underground, what do you mean? But, um, I think I was supposed to come up here the normal way or something? I don't know what happened, but Patrick was not talking to Mer or Barnacle Boy properly. So yeah, this takes us up here. So, I guess we're just gonna go ahead and start hitting those buttons. So yeah, let's go over here. And we just take the watermelon and this. Oh, I see, it's like one, it's like one of these little puzzles. Okay, I get it. It's gonna turn multiple at a time. Get three at a time in a row. Whoa, that's blown up. Okay, so we gotta turn them all to the power side. Let's hit that one. And that one. Might take me a bit. Okay, so actually, maybe we should turn this one. Oh no, wait. Not that one. Yeah, th this might take me a second to figure out, but I will get this. I promise. We hit that. And that one. And then I think I think we're good. So we hit this. And then this one and it should be good. I think I just solved it. Let's go. It didn't, it didn't take me that long. Yeah, there we go. They're on the power side now. So bad, they're all powering. Well how much if I hit them again now though? Oh, it will turn it off. Well, actually, no, it's still sending power, so it doesn't matter. Let's turn it back, though. Okay, cool. So let's go talk to Barnacle Boy. I did your job, boy. Ah, uh, well done. Now there's enough power. What do you need all that power for? Why, my foot bath, of course. Here, have a golden spatula. What, what kind of foot bath do you have and you need this much electricity for, bro? Anyways, let's go with the spatula. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Yeah, even co like compared Barnacle Boy to Mermaid Man, Barnacle Boy is, I mean, Mermaid Man is like extra HD, even compared to Barnacle Boy. But, um, I guess we're just gonna go down this slide now. I don't see another way down. Let's like, no. Oh. That just takes me back to where I was, so slide time. Whoa. How many of these do I have to carry? Oh, a sock. It's a sock. I think I can't really hit it, unless I go back. Oh, oh, I'm dead. Okay, let's go back down the slide. We need that sock, so we're gonna go for it. Watch this. Oh! Oh, Give me it. Okay, I got one. it. We're good. Let's go, we got the sock. Okay, so was there anything else to do over here? I don't think so. Um, yeah, I think we need to be SpongeBob now because I see a bubble bowl thing over there. Wasn't there a bubble bowl thing over here? Or was that up there with Barnacle? No, it was up there with Barnacle Boy, I don't think. Uh, yeah, okay, so we're gonna head this way, because there's a button there that I don't know what it does, but I want to figure it out, so... 
Yeah, but we already collected two golden spat. Pretty good. Uh, There's nothing like oh, a smell of oh, uh, in the morning. Oh, is that it's the thing I life. saw when I fall when it's I fell? Uh, this thing was down there, and then we just rose it up. I think that's what happened. So yeah, I guess we'll just head on this for now. Gotta get our exercise in. Or right, anyway, hey, don't throw that tactical nuke at me. Get out of here. Attack. Yeet! There you go. Ow! I blew up. So now let's just wall jump. Here. Blow up. Smack this dude. Now what? What was up? Nothing. I feel like a new sponge. Is there is there nothing I could do up here yet? Bro? I guess not. I can switch characters. Is this gonna switch me to Patrick? No. Yeah, I can switch to Patrick. I even can you even wall jump with Patrick? Can't. I must have to come back here later then. So we'll go back to SpongeBob and then we're gonna head to that right area. So yeah, we're gonna head that way. So jump up well, over where that bubble bowl thing is right there. Head to that. So yeah. Whoa, I almost fell. I feel like that these things are going to activate at some point. And it's going to, like, maybe probably lead to a more special. Get out. Get out of here. One shot. I missed. Whoa. Ugh. Yeah, what did that do? Oh, this platform lowered right here. What does this do? Does this take me up? It does. Oh, okay. Yeah, look, all of these are also still off. He's trying to attack the nuke me. Ow, he succeeded. He successfully nuked me left wall. Oh, we gotta turn those on. That's how. That's why. Okay, that makes sense now. So we gotta turn on both of the wall jump sides to get up there. Oh, okay. like a spring breeze. Let's go over here. And then there's this... Oh, uh, what's the arf? Yeah, yeah, I hit him. Yeah, get your ankles broken. Oh, oh, where are you going? Where are you going? I'm on you. I am on you. Come here. Get clapped. You never stood a chance. You never stood a chance. Alright. So I think that's lowering another platform, yep. Let's head in here. Get risen up. Um, I yep, I was like, please. Uh, body that. I guess that's where we're gonna, I think that leads to the next area. What are those flashing lights over there? Let's activate the next wall jump. Yep, so we can get up there now. But is there anything else for me up here? There's the slide. Oh, I think that's just a quicker way to get back so I can do the wall jump now. Yeah, cause I don't see a way up there yet. Um, so I guess we're just gonna take the slide. I'm just looking around, make sure I'm not missing anything. But I don't think I am, so we're gonna go ahead and hop on this slide. Let's go! Bam, nan, nan, bam, nan, nan. Oh, the OSD is fire! Ow! Oh, oh, watch this. Okay, well, they, oh, I went the wrong way, anyways. Well, never mind. Don't watch that. So do these damage? They do. Okay. I needed to be sure, because they didn't look activated, so I was like, maybe they don't damage me, but they do. So, yeah, let's go this way. The fastest way to travel is jump. Not this. So, yeah, now we can head up to that area. So, I don't know why we can switch to Patrick here, though, because I can't use him. So, I, I don't know what the point of it is, but, yeah. I'll jump. Can you make it? Thank you. Please. Um, there's a sign over here. That, there's a golden... Let's, let's grab the spatula first, real quick. Pick it up. So is this the supercomputer that they were talking about? Because I know they said I need to go talk to the computer. So is that... Oh yeah, Squidward was saying this is what this is. In Let's order for me to regain control of the security system, you need to press all the override buttons spread throughout the Mermelair. The first one is here. Press the buttons! Got it! When you have pressed them all, you should return here to press the master shutdown button. You will be rewarded. Return here! Got it! Are you listening to me? Listening! Got it! Sp Spongebob just wanted to do his voice. Alright, so... So I guess we have to go through other areas and hit all those. Does this box lead anywhere, by the way? It does. Oh, it leads all the way back to the beginning. Okay, this that's very convenient. So I guess maybe we have to come back for that top middle area. You see, like, the very top where all those, those water tubes and stuff are? Because we can't get there yet. At least not from what I saw. Hey, let's look at it from here. Yeah, there's, there's like no way up there that I can see, so we'll worry about that later. Uh, then I guess this is like that master override bunch you were talking about. We can climb onto this. Oh, we can talk, we can talk to her. Talk to her, let's Spongebob, see. press all of the security override buttons throughout the Mermelair. Then return here and press the master shutdown button. She says the same thing. 
wonder who's, who voices him. Ooh, don't think I didn't see. Oh, it's Underworld. I thought it was a Sock. I was like, don't think I didn't see that back there. It, it was just Underworld. That would have been a nice spot to hide a Sock. But, um, I guess we're going to head left unless we can't. I don't think we can go right yet. Let's see what this sign has to say about it. Let's see. Press the Mermaid. Mer Blech. Press the master shutdown button to lower the bridges to the villain containment system area. Okay, so once we hit all the override buttons, then we can do this. So I'm assuming we just gotta move on to the next area. You said they're spread throughout here. Security tunnel. Gary! I see you've made your way down to the deepest recesses of the Mermalair. Wow! Oh, you took the elevator. Oh, how do I get to the top of this room? Meow. You're right. I bet those tunnels will take me up to the top. Good thinking, Gary. Why is Gary just vibing everywhere? Like, everywhere we go, he's just vibing somewhere. He was unfazed by the smack. Look at this. He's a god. He doesn't care. Look. He, like, he, like, stretches a little bit, and then he's like, yeah, I'm good. Gary is a god. All right, let's hit that guy. Um, yeah, we just got to traverse to these tunnels, I guess. Like they were saying, so let's just kill as many enemies as we can. Nice. Get them out of here. Um, but yeah, Gary's just chilling down here for some reason. But oh, there we go. These guys. Okay, so yeah, we just gotta explore around, get up there. I'm I'm assuming there's gonna be more buttons and stuff in here because we still gotta hit all the buttons for the computer. So let's go. That box is open, right? Okay, yeah. Yeah, Gary's just every, everywhere. What elevator leads down here anyways? Like, we had to jump down a tube. Gary had an elevator? Like, what? Alright, easy, easy. Alright. Pass that up. It was, was a little dude going past. But not Zahando. Come here. Get slam dunk, bro. I love opening presents. So, that dude was just sneak around. Made it easy. Easy work. Watch this. Clap. Easy clap. Whoa, look at how big. This in here. That's going to change. Okay. There we go. Okay. Made it. Look at all these pipes, though. Because there was even pipes in rock bottom. I wonder if all these pipes are actually going to lead to something at the end. Because, yeah, there's a bunch of water pipes in rock bottom. There's a bunch of them here. Maybe it's like plankton's like fuel for the robots or something. I don't know. But all I know is that there's a lot of them. I do something about those guys. Oh, we just have to. Okay, yes. Yeah, Lasers move. We just gotta jump around. Them. Okay. We're getting close to the top, so let's just keep going. Got a checkpoint. Perfect. Um. Just gotta wait. This one out. It seems simple enough for how it works. Whoa! Gotta walk slowly. Gotta walk slowly. Going steady wins the race. I got shot, but like I'm gonna just leave him there. Honestly, <laughs> he can stay there. <laughs> he, he can. He can just stay there for the rest of his life. Look how many areas. Whoa! Made it easy, and he tried to tactic nuke, bro. Get slapped. Ooh! Look at that little combo. I did my forward air as the sponge. Well, speaking of that, uh, so recently, while you know. In the past few days, they revealed that we're getting a, Nick, a game called Nickelodeon All Star Brawl, I think, something like that. It's basically Nickelodeon Smash Bros. And I'm completely here for it. Like, I'm ready to make content on that game. I'm gonna, make, I'm gonna be having some videos, probably streams on it, too, honestly. Let's get this dude. Where are you going? Oh, he just stays here. So he can just body him. Easy now. But yeah, I'm excited to make, like, videos and stuff on that game because that's gonna be fun. And I wanna see who the full roster is, though, though. But yeah. I want to see what the full roster is, though, because they haven't revealed everyone. They just revealed some of them. Oh, so to take the upper path. Okay, because they, they dropped a trailer, but it didn't show off every single character. Oh, here's a button. Oh, okay, only two more. Let's collect the spatula, and then we're going to head up to the upper area. We have 40 spatula. We actually have enough spatulas to move to the next area if we, if we wanted to, but no. Yeah. But, um... Let's see what's up here. But, yeah, just... I'm ready for that new, the, the Spongebob yeah. Smash Bros game. Oh! Well, not Spongebob Smash Bros, but like Nickelodeon. Um, you know what? I'm just going to jump off because I fell this far down. And I don't feel like climbing all the way back up. So, yeet! 
Oh, wow. Well, we spawned back here. Anyway. Okay, well, <laughs> that was a waste of time then. We were going to have to do this. Anyway. Let's just yeah, let's just take the damage. There's heals right here. Like trying to speed run this. Oh, <laughs> well, yeah. So that new SpongeBob, like, or not Sp I keep saying SpongeBob, Nickelodeon Smash Bros. game looks really good. And it's, apparently it's going to even have rollback netcode, which is hilarious. Because a lot of people have been pointing out how, like, like not even breeze. normal Smash Bros. has rollback. Fighters doesn't have rollback. Like, all of these more popular games don't have rollback, but Nickelodeon Smash Bros. is going to have rollback netcode, which if you don't know what that I is, like a new uh, I don't know exactly how to explain it, so the simplest way yeah, I can boy. put it is it's a yeah, newer, boy. I don't know if it's new actually, but it's basically the best form of online connection <laughs> that's out right now. It's the ro yeah, rollback netcode. It's like when you connect with people online, it's the best form of that. So everyone just like, it's just hilarious how that... This new Nickelodeon Smash game is gonna have rollback before, you know, all these other games get rollback. Cause like, cause like, uh, if you know anything about fighting games, so there's this game called Guilty Gear, that game has rollback netcode. But like, of course it doesn't. It's, it's fighting. No! I fell. Oh Wait, I could've taken the box! Oh yeah, let's actually just walk back and take the- Oh no, we're right, we're right back up here. Okay, we're not gonna worry about killing that guy again. But, um... Yeah, so the, this new Nick, Nickelodeon Smash game has rollback, but like there's so many other games that don't, and people are like, that's just hilarious. And there's been so many memes about it though, because you know a lot of people are just excited for it, which I'm excited for it too, because I honestly though it would be even better. That like that game would be even better. Oh, we got a song with it. To have this back. Oh, what is this? Back to the yeah, back to the game. Okay, so that was all for a song. But that game would be even better if they maybe like for a sequel or something. They start doing every other cartoon. Like, not just Nickelodeon, they start doing Disney and Cartoon Network too. I feel like that would bring out a lot of potential and make it, like, pr like a pretty good rival for Smash Bros, like, actually. <laughs> so, yeah, I'd love to see it, but I'm excited to see the full roster. Uh, I don't know who I want to main yet, but I just feel like there's a lot of characters that are going to be... Like, I feel like the Ninja Turtles are going to be top tier. They're going to be annoying to fight. Spongebob's probably going to be, like, mid. Uh, I don't know. There, there, there's, like, a lot of different ways it could go, but once the game is out... I'll like probably I'm gonna definitely do some content on it and stuff once I get it because that game actually looks really good and hopefully it is as hopefully it's as good as it looks but anyways we're gonna head to the rolling ball all right what is this place rolling ball so I'm assuming we have to use a lot of this I hit Let's go hit him right in the face. Uh, Alright, so... I don't know if I was supposed to hit here first, actually, but we're gonna. So let's roll, hit that. Is that... Well, that activated that. I don't know what... <laughs> oh, are you setting up like a Rube... A Rube... How do you pronounce it? Rube Goldberg? A Goldberg machine? Is that what's happening here? That's kind of cool if so. Oh, there's Mr. The button turned off. Oh, we gotta time it. Okay. Oh, so we have to walk around to these timing it? Let's hit this real quick. Yeah, I think we gotta walk around to like all these different things and actually time when this is gonna do stuff. That's gonna be interesting. We probably gotta be pretty quick. Oh, that's the next area right there. Okay, so let's go talk to Mr. Crab. Oh, the spatula is actually sealed up. Okay. Let's talk to Mr. Crab, see what he has to say. Look, boy! There's gold under that glass! Gold, I say! My eyes are getting sweaty just looking at it! All you have to do is get that great big ball into that there cup. How do I get the ball rolling, Mr. Krabs? You start the process by bubble bowling up this ramp to hit that button. Good luck, SpongeBob. My wallet's counting on you. Why is he staring straight at the camera like that? That's a little threatening. Like, back up, Mr. Krabs. Jeez. Face on my camera. Anyways, um... So yeah, I'm gonna explore around a bit, see what we have to do. So yeah, I think we gotta follow the ball in time when we're gonna do all this. This is gonna be probably at least a little different. Like, let's see, what is this? We stop the hammer. What did that do? I don't know what it does. Hit that button, but like, for what? <laughs> what does it do? I have no idea what this did. I guess we'll just leave it pressed though. Um, where does this dude keep coming from? I don't know where the respawn is. Uh, let's see, what is, where does this platform take? Nowhere, it's just healing. Okay. I thought I was gonna move. He's healing like, he's coming from like off screen somewhere. I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't know what this button does. It does something though, I'll tell you that much. Um, 
So then this is like the final little segment. Oh, we have to move. Oh, this is going to be. We're going to be here for a minute. This might actually go into next episode. Unless I get it like first try. But yeah, we have to tilt this ourselves. This is going to be uh, quite the challenge. Um, what is this fan for? Oh, I guess once the ball's in there, this fan will blow. And oh, that's probably what will open up the glass, right? Yeah, I'd assume. I don't know. I don't know what this fan has to do with anything. But we have to get the ball into that cup. To, so, and the, the fan's connected. So, yeah, depend. Oh, we had to hit the button afterwards. Okay. So, I guess we're just going to go ahead and give it a shot. Hold on. One thing I need to check. How do we spin this? How, does, how do we spin this? Uh, I don't know. Be able to turn by itself? I have no idea. But let's just go ahead and get the ball rolling. There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. So it smells like down. victory. And what? Is that what hitting this does? That turn the. Oh, how do we turn that? We gotta turn it. I just don't know how. Oh, do we? Do we, do we use this? Oh, we do do this. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't sure. Okay, so then that will roll to that hammer. But what do we do with the hammer? Can we swing the hammer somehow? Can we somehow swing this hammer? I don't know. Oh. Oh, like that. I see. Okay. So the ball is going to go into here. And then I think we slam down on this to like launch it. Uh, yeah, launch it up onto that. It's gonna roll that way. And it's gonna come down here. Oh, but this is time. You gotta be quick about this. One. Okay. Just like, how did I get it now? Did I do it? Yeah, we just hit it. Okay. Yeah, this is gonna be tough. So then, can we slam down on this to launch it? No, it'll go by itself. Okay. And then it'll come down here, and that's when we hit this button. And then we gotta run this way real quick. Get up there. Did you saw that? I was like just riding him. Oz, I was riding on him. That doesn't sound any better. Okay. Um, we gotta hit that button. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and give it a shot now that I understand how it works. In order for the ball to reach the edge, I know. <laughs> thank you, Mr. Gr I mean, thank you for the advice, but I got it now. I know what I'm doing. Okay, this is gonna come down. And I'm gonna go ahead. Should I just turn it right now? I guess so, yeah. I'm just turn it. Keep it turned. Hopefully it stays long enough. Yeah, okay. Now let's run over here. Oh, we gotta, we gotta do this quick. We gotta go quick. There we go. Did it, we doing it? We did it too late. I'm, st I'm stuck. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, so basically, as soon as we turn this platform, we gotta run over there and hit that. Yeah, this might take us in the next episode, because we're coming up on the end of this one. Hit that. Immediately just do this, and then we're going to run over here. I don't know if that was too early or whatever, but we kind of need to get this going. Quick. Especially if I'm going to fail my jumps like this. Do that. The ball's on the way. Okay. We got it. It fell off. Great. Yeah, I turned it too early. Okay, so we're going to have to wait a second before we do that. All right, I'm going to give it like two more shots, and if we don't get it, I'm just going to do it next episode. <laughs> so, yeah, okay, let's roll it now. Turn that. Okay. Go, 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 go. Get up here. Get up there. In that. Ball's on the way. We got to stand on this. Perfect. Scoop successful. Is it going to make me watch that every time? Probably. Okay, so it's rolling down. Where's it at? It's up there. Once it starts getting toward the bottom, actually, we gotta do it now. Let's turn that. Then we gotta. Oh, we gotta get to this part. Hopefully, I didn't do that super early. I can't do it super early. No, 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 no! It's gonna fail. No, no! Quick! There's nothing like the smell of bubbles okay, in the yeah, morning. Okay, yeah, you know what? I'll give it one more shot, and if we fail. It we will shines. do it next episode. So, yeah, just enjoy me trying to do I'm going to focus. So I'm going to be quiet here. So y'all get to just enjoy the music and stuff.
Okay, we, we messed it up again. So, yeah, I'm going to just head down. <laughs> and we're going to stand by Mr. Krause. We're going to end the episode off right there. It's been 30 minutes. We don't want to make this too long. But we did get a lot done. Let's see. How many spatulas did we get again? So we got... We got five already? What the heck? Yeah, we've already got five spatulas. We're basically... We're literally almost done already. Ne like, next episode, we should pretty much finished <laughs> so yeah because we only have two more socks we have one more button and three spatulas left. like yeah we got a lot done this episode geez i did not realize we got five spatulas i thought we got like two <laughs> I, I guess i wasn't paying attention i don't know but yeah we're gonna end off the episode right there so thank you all for watching hope you all enjoyed if you did make sure you hit that like button make sure you go down there and subscribe if you're new or even if you're not new and you're just not subscribed yet go ahead and do that uh or if you don't want to subscribe you know it's cool too you don't have to but if you are enjoying my content and you want to you know know when i upload you want to get there earlier and you don't want to miss any uploads then subscribing and turning on notifications would be the best option to do that so yeah and if you like this video that much this specific video if you liked it that much make sure you go ahead and put it down into your favorite playlist that's our little thing here on the channel so yeah but until next time i'll see you all later and peace have a good day or night